<coughs> all right back at it I'm uh putting out one more swarm trap I'll probably put it over there in that direction I'm starting to learn I need to tilt my head way up because I keep my camera right it's just I'm still figuring out how to do angles but anyway I'm gonna put it somewhere over there uh, maybe over there somewhere maybe on that tree I don't know I got I know from what I read they gotta put it facing uh, evening sun setting evening sun sunsets pretty much over there so probably and they say pick a big dominant tree that's what I've heard not what I've been doing so far but it, <laughs> I'm learning so I'm gonna put this one probably in that big oak over there way over there you can see that still kind of far but uh what I'm doing is I I had bought a whole hive set from uh, Kelly Bees. And when they sent me this hive, the, the bottom, the base of it was really damaged bad. And so was the nuke I had ordered. Then uh, that's up in that tree over here. I'm gonna have other videos I probably put together. It's up in that tree right there. But uh, I need to make a top for this because they ended up sending me another bottom and I you that's it that's the new one the other one i put back together glued it all back together you know i could have done that in the beginning but hey you know you pay for something you don't want it to arrive all beat up and it was beat up i mean it was boards were cracked at the glue back together so anyway they did right and they just sent me another one let me keep the other so i put them back together now i'm all set and they and included in the kit with two of these lower boxes full frame lower boxes full size and uh I'm gonna turn those into traps right now because I ain't got no bees so might as well use them for traps if I ended up catching more than one swarm well I'll just buy some more boxes and I'll start with you know one but I do have to make I have to make some tops for them so that's what I'm gonna do here with some wood that I had that was given to me and that's where I'm at. So I'm gonna show some videos of me putting up that other uh, swarm trap that's on the other side of the property over there, but they're looking to the sun to see it. But I'm gonna spread them out. I could probably put, I could probably put 10 swarm traps out on this six acres, so. But, you know, I think three will be a good start. I could do more if I used the, uh, Let's see if I use those medium supers and I got another found uh, another base for the uh, for another nuke and I can make the boxes in the tops for that and make that so I can make I could probably if I have the time make two three three more in addition to this three I could probably make put six of them up and it probably wouldn't hurt to have make bases and boxes and stuff like that but i got other projects that i'm trying to get done today because this is one of my rare days off and it's one of the rare days when you had rain it's just also a rare day in that it's frigidly cold well not frigidly cold for us over here in the south it was down in the 20s and it's march we, we this is a, the third time this winter we saw 20s and it happens to be in march when we see it so it's crazy but it's gonna warm up nicely with that sun out. I say it hits the upper 50s to lower 60s today. So I wanna get these swarm traps, what I can get today in place. And oh, I just got some swarm commander. So I'm gonna try that out. I had tried baiting the other day with lemongrass oil, but I don't know. I might have that in a video, I don't know. Uh, so anyway. Anyway, what I'm doing right now, uh, this little bit of a video is gonna be I'm gonna try and set out what would be I guess a swarm trap for lack of any other color it is it's gonna be a swarm trap <coughs> so <coughs> I've got these right here I don't even know if you have to 
put these in there or not. I don't know. I don't even know if it's necessary as far as do this, but I went, I guess. I don't know. I'm learning. Huh. I'm kind of new to this whole scene here. Oh, shoot. I guess if you do it like that, that don't work. in the middle i mean i don't have any i don't this is brand new hives this is my first time doing this so if i i wish i had some frames with that had propolis or whatever on them some old comb frames or something but uh i'm not so fortunate when you're starting out and no one has any videos of someone starting from total scratch like this all the people that do this they have hives already yeah they're well under their way oh, we got some wind i'm gonna lose that paper i can see it getting ready to go i'll be chasing it down if i don't so i'm gonna do this with Brand new, brand spanking new hive uh, boxes. Uh, it ain't a hive until you get the bees in it, I believe. Hive box. Caught it right at the last second there. Alright. So, I did order the Swarm Commander. But then it's going to be a while before that comes in. So, I'm just going to set up this with I'm gonna try and give it a try I do happen to have I do happen to have lemongrass oil uh, that's pretty common to have around your house if you live with women I guess and both my girls seem to like those essential oils so they had it so I'm stealing some of it from them. Looks like one, two, three, four, five, six frames have some kind of wax on them. Now I'm just going to put these uh, swamp trap, I uh, just swamp trap up in a random area. I know I got bees on this property. I'll show them to y'all later. I got a hive. I got a hive that's in a tree on this property. And I have a swarm trap I put up last year across from, but I, I put it up at the end of last year. We only just moved to this place a little over a year ago. 
so I'm just I'm <laughs> still in the exploratory mode a lot so so what I'm gonna do is just this ain't no real scientific method here this is basically just gonna be <laughs> slamming up pretty sturdy okay not totally level of course but it'll do all right uh, all right that's pretty sturdy And level enough okay. for me. Hopefully, now, that's another trap set up on my property. Uh, see, I got flowers right there already blooming. I don't know what that is. That looks like jasmine, maybe. Yellow jasmine? Possibly. I had put that other swarm trap out. That's one swarm trap right here. Nothing's in it, but I just baited it with lemongrass oil today. So it's up in that tree. <clears throat> that one's pretty high, and I put it high because I was trying to put it kind of even with this tree that's right across from here. to get this.
They're right there. Alright everybody, this is my resonant hive, resonant beehive, I tried to record them before but I didn't have a steady enough hand and this I got a tripod so it's a little jerky when I try and move but Look at that. That's my girl. Hopefully I'm gonna catch when they swarm. Yeah, they're looking good, huh? They're moving a lot. Oh, shoot. Boy, they got some pollen on them, huh? They are loaded to the gills.
and then come out. Spin around. And that's why I got the swarm trap. One of them.
All right. Too bad it'll work time to go put the base up to the platform up uh, I want to put this one a little higher than the last one as close as possible. That's not too bad, really. Actually, how it's supposed to be. All right, <laughs> I know, I know, uh, everybody, <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> but it's gonna work. Well, that gets it up there. Uh, that's a little over six foot high, I guess. And, I am going to do something to make a little entry. Right, what I'm gonna do sir. is I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna try and make me one of these. All right, I'm gonna. Exactly scented, but doesn't need to be. <laughs> Very unconventional way of doing things I have, but Okay, I only have five deep left, five deep frames left, so I got these mediums for the supers, and that's just going to have to go in there, because I'm going to, I know you're supposed to leave Leave uh, from what I read. Oh shoot, that's breaking. I know you're supposed to leave some open from what I, I saw on some of the YouTube song 
trap us videos so I'm not a hundred percent sure how I'm gonna want to do this but I'm gonna just do what I can do and that's it that's Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut them and just get them on the top strip. and make them. I know there's starting frames that have the boards, wood. I don't have that. Actually, what I'm looking for right there and it kind of seems to hold itself in place so maybe it'll work maybe it won't I don't know okay <laughs> hopefully it stays It's something. <laughs> More new beekeepers, huh? That's what I can do. Kind of push them flat, so that's right there. terrible this is mix matching these frames but it's what I have to do to get these out right now hate me if you want to that's all right Disturbed in there like that, but 